think I know what that for, but Sprint Medley and four by I one. think the 100, the 4x1, and the 4x2. So what's it like doing three relays like that over the weekend? Uh, I think it should be fun. I'm not really a big fan of doing a bunch of relays. I do doing my individual individual events, especially since the 4x2 is not at like nationals and whatnot, but I think it should be fun. Yeah, what do you think about having this big relay event in Fayetteville? Uh, Chris was just talking about, you know, wanting to kind of have a showcase event here for you guys, especially the seniors, you know, kind of for your last home meet. Yeah, I think it should be really fun, and it will be kind of the biggest home outdoor meet that we've had, at least since I've been here. So I think it should be real fun to have a lot of people who usually don't come here, like Florida and whatnot. So I think it should be real nice, nice meet. It's going to be live. Uh, Saturday night's going to be live on the SEC Network. A lot of times, you know, college track doesn't get live coverage like that. How how exciting is that for you as an athlete to get to, you know, run on live on national TV? Uh, I personally don't really care about that because I'm just going to run regardless. So, it doesn't really matter to me. Or do you like the idea of showcasing the event, showcasing the showcasing the facility on TV? Yeah, I guess so. I guess that's you know good for the the school and whatnot. But personally, I don't really care. Okay. Uh, hey, uh, as a senior, um, I know you got other, you got the SECs and the NCAA's and everything, um, but but just, it, how would you kind of sum up your career here to this point? Um, what, what's it been like running for the Razorbacks? And, and you've been what in a sixteen-time All-American, I think, yeah. or something like that. I've had a lot of, a lot of good times here, at Arkansas. I really enjoyed it. I think if I could do it again, I'd still come here, and I'm just ready to close it out and kind of try to. I think I started out real well, and I just want to end it real well. You guys had some pretty lousy weather to deal with, but it sounds like it's going to be pretty decent Saturday night. Are you excited about that? And what do you think you guys are capable of doing if the conditions are good? I think it should be a really good meet for all of us, especially since we're finally going to have some decent weather, and hopefully it won't be super windy like it has been. So I think it can definitely set us up for some good times. Are you excited that all these you know Power 5 teams are coming in? You know, it's yeah. It's a pretty good field. Yeah, because – Probably my biggest complaint would be our outdoor meets. We don't have any good teams really coming. It's a <laughs> bunch of like junior colleges and whatnot. And because that means like outdoors, we don't really have anyone to race against, especially home. But indoors, we have a lot of good meets right. and a lot of people come. So that's kind of just, just kind of weird just not to have that kind of competition outdoors. What do you what? think the competition level will be like this weekend? How will that push you guys? I think it – it would be really different, and it's just because it kind of depends on what the other teams, if they have their best athletes run in certain relays and whatnot. But I think if everyone decides to run, uh, put together a good relay in each event, I think it should be a good meet. What does that kind of competition do for you in this type of meet? I would say that it gives us that preparation and just kind of getting used to be able to run against teams like that because we need – the kind of practice because you can't just go to SECs. It's like a different feel beyond having to run up against big shots and people can run fast or throw far, or jump far. You got Florida, Florida State, Tennessee mm-hmm. among the teams coming in, you know, sprint powers traditionally. Mm-hmm. How excited are you to get to run against teams like that? It's not the SEC meet, it's, it's a meet here at home. Yeah, I'm definitely really excited for that because, like I said, it's we don't get to see that very much. Um, so it's going to be really exciting, to be, best you do it at home. So it should be real nice. Have you, have you thought about this being your last home meet? I, I assume you're not going to run the last chance qualifier. Uh, I probably will run at, at twilight, so next week will be my last meet. Okay. Well, in terms of getting a big home meet, mm-hmm. you know, Jack was talking about, Jack yeah. was talking about wanting to go out the bang. How do you feel about, you know, a big home meet here kind of cum- culminating your, you know, your college career? Well, I think it will be a kind of a bittersweet moment. I'm going to remember my freshman year, and then now all of a sudden I'm about to have my last home meet here. So it should be a, a bittersweet moment running for my last time in front of Fayetteville.